What vaccines should parrots get? Luckily, parrots tend to be quite healthy and robust and don't require vaccines. Parrots usually live in relative isolation in the sense that, as companion pets, people have them in various homes and they don't encounter other parrots other than when maybe they're bred or at a store or maybe if they're at a shelter or rescue. So other than those moments, presumably people might only have one or several parrots in their home so the opportunity to be exposed to illness is significantly lower. Furthermore, parrots have a high uh, body temperature, the equivalent of, of a fever for us, so they're pretty resistant to most bacterial infections as an adult. For the most part, parrots are not very far divergent from their wild ancestors, so they don't have too much inbreeding, so they tend to have pretty good genetics for a um, good immune system and resistance to illness. Now, there are some illnesses that can be quite catastrophic for parrots, so prevention is really the best way. It's important not to have parrots introduced to other parrots that might have that illness, so it's important to have disease testing for that matter. Some of the more prominent and lethal parrot illnesses that are good to test for are PBFD, which is also called beak and feather disease, polyomavirus, and Pacheco's disease, as well as psittacosis. You can't always detect uh, the illnesses. Parrots don't always look sick when they have these. You see, a lot of parrots can be carriers for some of these because different parrots come from different continents and different species, where some species are more harmed by these illnesses than other parrots. So it is perfectly possible for one species of parrot to come in contact with that illness and be a host for it, but not succumb to the symptoms. However, when another parrot comes in contact with the ill bird, that parrot could have serious uh, and possibly lethal uh, reaction to that illness. So for this reason, it is quite important to use disease testing to get an inside look whether or not they have those. These illnesses are particularly harsh on young uh, chicks when, when they're babies, but can also be devastating to an adult that comes into contact with them later on, so prevention is key. Polyoma is the only one of these that has a developed vaccine, and it is recommended for Eclectus and Caiques because they are particularly susceptible to the illness. For other parrots, good measures, uh, good hygiene, and testing are almost always sufficient to protect them from these illnesses. In any case, it's a good idea to contact and consult with an avian veterinarian to learn about which illnesses your particular parrot species is more susceptible to and which testing is recommended prior to introducing new birds to your group. Be careful, stay safe, and thanks for watching.